So about a minute away from that entry burn, uh, if you look on the bottom left-hand side of your screen, there is a velocity gauge of the first stage. And so as we go through that entry burn, um, you'll start to see that we are slowing down the speeds uh, of the first stage. But actually, even after we complete the entry burn, as we go through the, the denser parts of the Earth's atmosphere, we'll continue to scrub speed. Uh, and in fact, the majority of the speed um, is actually uh, uh, scrubbed by the Earth's atmosphere. talked a little bit about the engines uh, and the different engines on the Falcon 9 vehicle. On the right-hand side of the screen, that is uh, the Merlin vacuum engine. And it's optimized to perform in the vacuum of space and can produce over 220,000 pounds of thrust. Uh, the engines on the first stage are stage one, entry burn, optimized startup. to perform at sea level, and they can produce uh, over 190,000 pounds of thrust uh, during both ascent and descent. And you can see that we have indeed started our entry burn. Uh, this is expected to last for about 20 seconds before we shut off those three engines once again. And while Falcon 9 makes its way back... Stage one, entry burn, shut down. You may notice the different sit markings on the outer coverings of the rocket. Uh, pretty much as we're returning to Earth, uh, we're flying through our own exhaust. And so that's where the sit will start to build up around the Falcon 9 first stage. So we did have successful entry burn. The first stage has stage one, one more AFT burn to go. Saved. It's going to happen in about a minute and 15 seconds. Uh, before we start the landing burn on the first stage, we are going to be listening for a call out for the second stage, which is SECO. That stands for Second Engine Cutoff 1. The second stage, stage engine two, terminal guidance. will uh, shut off and enter a coast phase for about 20 minutes, and then we'll actually be reigniting the second stage engine for a second time. Uh, we'll shut it off for a second time, coast for a little bit longer before we'll be deploying the NALSAT 301 satellite. So uh, we have a, a couple stage more sequences to go through before uh, we get that um, satellite stage free two, FTS is safe. to its targeted orbit. Stage one, landing burn. So we did get confirmation of a successful second engine cutoff, and we've also begun uh, the landing burn on the first stage. Nominal orbit insertion. So that call out for nominal orbital insertion is what we're waiting for for the second stage. Again, stage it is now one, parked, like 